Hey guys, Free Super Wii here, and man, it's been, what, five months since my last video? <laughs> oh man. Ugh. Let's see, is timer ready? Nope, it is not. We're on the last episode of The Walking Dead Season 2. That should do it. Press start and play. Man, it has been forever since I've done a playthrough, so if something goes wrong, I am sorry. Hope you guys can hear me alright. Let's go to the last episode. Episode 5, No Going Back. Yeah, so you're probably wondering, why have you been gone for so long? Well, Killing the reason being is I moved. Part of survival. And after moving, I, I had to get minute. stuff set up, and just, ugh, it's just a pain in the butt. It'll put you out of your misery I right moved then. from one state to another, so that's why it was so long. Now look at Kenny now. He just he seems broken. Broken people get broken. I'm not gonna say where, but let me just tell you, it was a pain in the butt. Thanks. <laughs> if things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. Drop it! Drop it! Drop it! Beat these guys! Beat The Walking Dead. Season 2. There's Clementine. That, what happened to her? She was standing. Quick, get to the baby. <laughs> Alright, just get over to that side of the wall. I can maybe get an angle on this guy. Cover me, alright? Just shoot over to his woods. I'll, I'll try. Yeah. Okay. Good. Good. I just need the distraction. Okay? Alright, on my go. Go! Hey, 
There we go. Luke, I'm sorry. It ain't your fault. He got me in the leg, but I think it went straight through. Shit, I don't know. I'm gonna be fine. I think I'm gonna be fine. Thank God she came. Safe to come out. Here, I got him. Jesus Christ. That was, uh, that was intense. I thought, man, I thought that was it. Yeah, it was for these assholes. Are you, are you okay? I, I think so. I didn't know this man. I never killed someone that didn't wrong me in some way, that didn't deserve it. I tried to pretend he was a walker, but it's different. You saved us. Yeah, that's why I did it, but... Felt wrong. Come on. Okay. This happened. She turned. Just like that. Don't you go blaming yourself, Kenny. You did what you had to to protect the boy. She just lost too much blood. Ain't nobody's fault. You know, we could have done better by her. She was just too far gone. She would have been a good mom. Yeah. Yeah, she would have. Don't worry, Becca. We'll take care of your boy. You rest easy. Kenny? You piece of shit! Ugh. Hey, hey! Stop! Guys, get guys, off me! Come on! It's over, man. He ain't a threat to us. How can you say that? Of course he is! Get out of the way! Whoa! What are you doing? I'm doing the same thing this asshole tried to do to us! It doesn't have to go down like that. Kenny, please! Kenny is... His sister is dead. He's lost enough already. We don't have to do this. There is house, food. Please. Please, I can take you. Bullshit! No, no. It's true. We have place. Not far. Food. See? He wants to help. Oh, don't be stupid. He's just trying to save his skin. Why the hell would you help us? Huh? I... I now want to see more people dead. Then close your eyes and I'll make it quick. Kenny, back off. If he's telling the truth, it could save all of us. And if it's a trap, we'll all be dead. We need the food. None of this will matter if we all starve to death. She's right, Kenny. We're running low on supplies as it is. It's worth the risk to check this place out. Trust him, don't trust him. It doesn't matter. We should go anyway. We just need to be careful. It can't be far from here. 
You stay out of this. You're the reason these fuckers came after us in the first place. Don't try and pin this on me. Lay off, Kenny. She just helped us. Look, don't start, all right? Don't blame her for what these people did. Think about the baby, Kenny. If there are supplies, we need them. We ain't gonna last much longer without more food. We gotta take a chance. Unless someone's got a better plan. We got something to t I got something. <laughs> oh, man, thank you. Just give me a reason. Yeah, man, he gets it. Man, why am I computer being so loud? Hope you guys can't hear that. Hope you guys can hear me. Ever since I've done one of these. I, I, said, I uh, said that already. I know but... you're probably pissed about me leaving. When I heard the gunshot, I knew it was a mistake. If it helps, the thing I'd normally do is walk away for good. But I didn't. Despite what my instincts are telling me. Despite everything I've seen. I'm not pissed. I'm glad you're back. I didn't want you to go in the first place. Thanks. That's... That's good. Because you're probably 90% of the reason I came back. And it'd probably get pretty annoying if you hated me the whole time. Wouldn't want it to be annoying. No. <laughs> that would suck. I'm gonna try to make this work. All I can do is... Promise you I won't abandon you again. Which, to be fair, I've never done before. Even though I probably should have. A few times now. You don't gotta point the gun at him the whole time. You forget what we just went through? He ain't going anywhere, Kenny. No need to get your arm all sore. I'm worried about Kenny. He's... He's in a dark place. We gotta keep an eye on him. Everything he's been through. That he's lost. Yeah, I've noticed that too. You're the only one that he trusts. That he really trusts. That means you're the one that's gonna have to pull him back. He's counting on you. If we're really going to make this work, we're all counting on you. It might be too late. I'm afraid of that too. But we still have to try. At least then we'll know for sure. Come on, slow pokes! Kenny's cool and all, but after season one and his problems in season two, uh, he has a he's a mess. Just need a second. Sorry, I just, I just put more weight on it than I should have. All right, wait there. Hey, what I say? When I tell you something, you fucking listen, you understand? Kenny, come on. There's no need for that. He's getting what he deserves. Kenny? I'm fucking talking to you. I say stop. You'd best stop. That's enough. Leave him alone. Just fucking stay put. I'm gonna have a word with Kenny. He doesn't have to treat him that way. Kid's been through enough. You all right here? Yeah, yeah. Go on and talk to him. I got Clam if I need anything. Okay. Here, just take the baby. Uh, okay. What is it with you guys? What do you mean? Every man I've known is always trying to let each other know how tough they are. Put them in their place. Bunch of dominant alpha male horse shit. And it all ends the same way. Now don't look at me. I ain't that guy. Oh, that ain't true. You get in your fair share of pissing matches too. Do I? They're just scared. That's when it happens. When they don't know what to do. Yeah, that makes sense to me. Guess it took a woman to talk some sense into him. Looks like Jane broke it up. Keep pressure on it, okay? 
I'm gonna go fetch some bandages. Hey, Bonnie. Yeah? I'm sorry. For what? I'll be right back. I'm really sorry about. Damn it. Don't worry. You're gonna be okay. a tree. Bullet in my leg. But alive. <laughs> when so many of my friends are dead for no good reason. And I couldn't do anything to stop it. Everyone we set out with just gone. Nick, Pete, Alvin and Becca, Carlos, Sarah. And for what? You can't blame yourself. We all made mistakes. Some of us more than others. I could have done more. And that ain't up for debate. I know it in my bones. And I gotta live with it. All right. This should work. That's perfect. What I miss? Hmm? Uh, nothing much. You know, complaining, mostly. I was just mentioning how cold it is lately. Yeah. Good thing you got that cool jacket, huh? <laughs> uh, I'm sure option. most of that'll come out with a little soap and water. I'm fine. Hey, Clem, go over and see if you can change the bandages on Kenny's wound. I offered, but I don't think he was comfortable with me doing it. But you know him better than I do. <sighs> okay, that a girl. That's gonna sting. But only for a second. It's gonna clean it. Oh, I know what it does. It's gonna suck. It's gotta get done. How long? I was thinking we'd go with Alvin Jr. What do you think? Rebecca mentioned she'd like to name him Alvin if it was a boy. I mean... Huh, yeah. I like it. Alvin Jr. it is. Do you like that? Well, I think AJ approves. What do you, uh, got there? Because I think I'm all right. I mentioned it earlier. I'm changing your bandage. Sounds like I don't have much choice in the matter. You don't. You shouldn't have to do stuff like this. Shouldn't have to do a lot of things. All right. Let's get it over with. Hopefully it don't scare this little guy. Or you. All right. Let's do this. It's okay. Huh? I trust you. Oh, you have to hold it. Up. Oh, come on. So how's it look? Still going to be pretty when this heals? I'm... I'm so sorry, Kenny. That bad, huh? You ain't got nothing to apologize for, Clementine. This wasn't your doing. All right. Ugh. Down. Oh, boy. I'm guessing this is going to be the shitty part. So this is going to hurt like hell. Well, you could have lied a little, you know. <laughs> Holy fucking hell. You need to stop squirming. Sorry about the language, Junior. You're gonna be tougher than me when you're grown. 
I'm gonna expect you to be more of a gentleman than I am. Man, is that smart. He can hear a few bad words. I've heard plenty. Yeah, that shouldn't have been the case. I should have gave myself up. Alvin didn't have to die like that. I'm gonna think about that every time I look at Alvin Jr. here. Alvin should be here, raising this boy. It should be him, not me. Carver's the one who did it, not you. Yeah, I suppose. But I can't help but feel guilty. All right, time to wrap up his face. Wrap up his face. Did I say it weird? All done. Thank you, sweetie. Yep. Are we ready to go? Okay, I'm gonna do it for part one of episode five, and I'll see you guys next time with more The Walking Dead Season 2. Bye!